So I was attending the May Day Rally at the time and we are May Day Rally. It's a fantastic event where work girls, unemployed work girls, people part of the movement come out to celebrate uh, the achievements of the, the movement past and focus our minds on what, we, what we, have, we still have to fight for in the 21st century. We hear, we hear speaking the day after the local election results, yeah. which has generated quite a bit of discussion about <laughs> Labour and how it did. What's your take on the results? Were you pleased with them? Yeah, I mean, I don't know whether I'm just ever optimist, but I think we had a really, really, really good uh, council election you know, process. The campaign was vibrant. We gained seats. The Tories lost seats. Uh, and ha you know how that could be positioned as some kind of um, you know some kind of defeat is quite absurd to me. Uh, so I, I think we I think we did really well. So there's more been these calls because you, to some people you didn't do well enough that Jeremy Corbyn should go. How do you respond to that? I mean, the idea that Jeremy Corbyn should not be the Labour leader because we gained council seats is, is quite something, to be honest. You know, Theresa May went into a general election hoping for an increased majority. They lost seats and she's still Prime Minister. Uh, so this idea that Jeremy Corbyn, after having gained seats, should not be the leader is, is an unbelievable twist on what has actually happened in the country. We have a government at the moment who is content on sanctioning unemployed workers, leaving them destitute, whose privatised medical assessments for disabled people are degrading, humiliating and punishing. On a more personal note, uh, I believe your first baby is yeah. due around the same time as the Durham Miners Gala. Is that going to generate a conflict of interest for you? <laughs> well, actually, there's a couple of things. There's the protest against Donald Trump the day before, so I'm hoping to get to that, and then the Durham Miners Gala the day after, which I would love to be at, and I'm sure I will be at, and hopefully not adding another kind of marcher to the gala, but uh, I'm due very soon after, so I'll probably be a bit uncomfortable, but I'm really, really looking forward to being a mom and the Member of Parliament for North West Durham.